It was last night that a massive tree was brought down in Manoa. We were the first to tell you about it. The banyan tree falling across the Lenny Drive. No one was hurt, but now residents are anxiously waiting for it to be removed. Kimberly Speakman has more. Bridget, I'm told this banyan tree blocks two houses and an entry point to several Manoa hiking trails. I spoke with one resident who is unable to reach his house because the tree blocks the entire street. Brandon Luck spent all day Monday with his wife in the hospital. When he returned home that night, he wasn't prepared for the sight that greeted him. As I was driving up, um, I saw uh, tons of uh, fire trucks. Uh, and just in a bit of state of shock. It was hard to see anything, but I knew that the pilot lines were down. There was a live wire. Since then, he's had to go through a neighbor's yard to reach his own home. I was expecting maybe that, that I'd see some workers here from the city to um, give me an update. Um, since I got information from the other owner of the house that the city may be coming and at least assessing it and starting to work on it. But residents tell us since the night the tree fell, no additional work has been done to remove the tree. Last night, the policeman told us that nobody showed up to take care of the, the tree, that uh, just phone 911 again and report it and try to find out what's going on. Mm -hmm. So I did that. The people that are down there right now, they need to get access into their home. So that's the main thing. And then it's the primary access to the uh, Manoa Valley. The tree isn't just blocking homes. It's blocking the entry to some nearby hiking trails. It was actually a real surprise. And then I was like, well, I still wanted to do this, so I have to climb over somehow. But it was really hard. And that's why I was like, when did this happen and why has nobody done anything about it? Because I feel like that's crazy that, like, such a big thing. It's like a huge obstruction. Yeah. We reached out to the city and county of Honolulu and the state DLNR to find out what's being done to remove the tree. We haven't received an answer yet, but we'll keep you updated. Bridget.